Alrighty, welcome back. Let's get our way back to the same place that we already been again. Oh yeah, here's my fucking sweet spaceship, by the way. Yeah. It's fucking huge. It's huge. I had the spaceships. Nobody has spaceships like me. Do you see this spaceship? It's huge. In fact, with my speed molt, I'm better off not flying everywhere. I've already, I think I've already maxed out that stat. Yeah, you have to do challenges to level up. That's why I'm saying you, there's only so much cheating you can do in this game because you can unlock the base skill or whatever. You can add your skill points and unlock the base one. Um, sweet. Anything else? You have to do challenges to get, oh, to get each one leveled up. Any more shit? Yeah, pretty much all the same commands still work, by the way. Let's make our way over there. Like, let me let me try this. I'll, I'll show you what I mean. So you can look up all these, by the way. Player.forceAV, speed molt 1, 50. I want to see if that's what I actually am on right now. Yeah, so I'm on 150, so shit. Shit, fuck. Tabbed out by accident. Player dot force AV. You can do mod AV as well, but that modifies it by a value. Force AV forces a set and it keeps it there. Look at that. <laughs> Wee! It looks like I'm going faster in first person though. That's weird. <laughs> it actually looks kind of fucking comical like this. Usain Bolt, bitch! Whoa, shit. Did you see that? Uh, it tweaked out there for a second. <coughs> oh, couldn't mute the mic in time. I still think I have to level up my sprint skill all the way anyways. What you have to do, people were complaining about this. They're like, oh, it, it, it doesn't work because I ran out of oxygen and it didn't level it up. No, you ran out of your base level of oxygen, but you didn't max out your CO2. That's how you do that challenge, by the way. So many people are conveniently fucking that up. Let's see, let's get back up it. Was it, was it in here? Yes. All right, let's make our way up in here. Come on. Look at all the detail though, you, you know, you gotta give them credit. I understand why they outsourced a lot of this game, all right? You know, you can't, don't hate on them for outsourcing detail work because stuff like this, come on. This shit would take forever, like under, under any normal circumstance. I don't remember where I go now. This way? Yeah. All the bodies. So see, I'm glad I... This is why you like to do optional things all the time. Because it can make your life pretty easy. Long run. Where next? What? What, what is going on? Am I going this way? I don't think I'm supposed to be. What the fuck? Maybe I am. I don't know. Is this the right way or did I just make a loop? It can get kind of confusing to navigate sometimes. Cool, all right, we got it. We're in. One second. All right, we're back. Got rudely interrupted. What are we doing?
Oh shit, damn it. Fucking thing. There we go. The music is pretty beautiful, by the way. You know, Zur did a good job. You know, don't hate on him. He's he's a boss. You must be the one who got me out of the red with the trade authority. Yes, sir. Can't say I don't appreciate it. Yes, sir. I doubt you came all this way just to do me a favor. Of course not. Now you want to explain to me why you're going around harassing the various <laughs> old men by wiping away their hard-earned debts? <laughs> Shut the fuck up, okay? Adrian sent you. Yeah, I'm doing She's chores did, for you. Did she look okay? Yeah, I almost want to say that, because... A Terramorph. She's fortunate to be alive at all. Hope you two had plenty of backup. Backup? It was just so me, mother bitch. You bring all the way down here after putting you in harm's way. said that huh if she made you come all the way for this let's get inside i need to see these cells you do and it's just you down here just hanging out doing fuck all damn hey red devils that's the name of my my card ah my graphics card that's the name of it oh i'm gonna ask you to not touch anything Got Thank some you. projects in the works down here. I wasn't expecting guests. Oh, and Lou mentioned how you took care of the dead. Can't say I'm thrilled the Trade Authority got their mitts on the research, but I guess that's the price you pay not to live in a cave the rest of your day. Yeah, be thankful, bitch. Come on, get to work. Hurry up. Everyone has time to waste. All queued up. Let's gaze into this abyss, shall we? We shall, yes. All Come right. on, proceed. Just get those cellular markers tagged. Come on! Wait. Where are the markers? This... This can't be right. What? Oh my this god. Sound, it's... Londinian. I'll... I'll need to get this all in the slate. Oh yeah? Adrian really gave me this sample. Because if you told me this was a hoax, and it'd be the best damn fake I've ever seen. I'd be mad and very, very relieved. I hate to break it to you. I collected the fucking thing. Can't just humor an old man, huh? This sample, it's got all the indicators of the worst Terramorph attack in human history. I presume you've heard of Londinian. I did. I actually walked through um, the fucking... I'm not only a UC native, I'm also a diplomat, dickhead, and I'm a vanguard. And I passed the optional listen to every little presentation in the fucking historical hall shit. Yes. And for good reason. The swarms are so bad, they had to blow the spaceport. And, and seal I the place off know the backstory that nobody else knows. Not a lot of samples made it off the Because I read terminals. The but the ones that did, well, they look just like this one. That's right. I didn't detect any of the telltale signatures. We did this to ourselves, is what I'm going to tell you. Spoiler alert. I don't think it was transported to Talzetti. This specimen, it grew there, faster than any Terramorph should. Which means, if we're about to start a new era in human Terramorph relations, where big, sudden Londinian-style attacks can happen outside Londinian, that's not going to end well for humanity. I know. It would be the end of us as a species. Well, wouldn't if we weren't all so pussy-made bitches? bad omen all the way here. You want to tell me what your plans are for it now? To fuck them all up, I'm the boss, okay? Get your boots on, bitch. The circle, huh? Here, faster we take the lift to the servants. Not supposed to use it, but... Yeah, thank you, thank God. And thank you for the key, by the way. He's now following me. Since <laughs> Sarah just fucking appeared. Let's take the lift, shall we? Get the fuck out of here. Let's go. Sorry, I just had to read my phone for a second there. Let's be honest though, this game does look beautiful though, despite it not being optimized, you need a 
$500 graphics card to run it at a reasonably smooth rate. It's pretty damn good. In fact, for all this, hold on. Well, no, I do want to sprint because it'll finish that challenge. Okay, we'll do it the hard way. We're almost there. We're like 2,000 meters into it. <clears throat> But yeah, this, the, the lighting, the volumetric fog and everything, they did pretty good with it. I really wish they would just use the dam. What is that shit called? You know, the dam. Fuck, what is it? You know. Oh my god. Joe Biden. That's who I am right now. That engine, bro. What? fuck is that engine called you know shit's sake I can't remember god damn it unreal engine yeah unreal engine 5 right 5 whatever it is why can't they just use that why, why isn't every game taking advantage of how awesome that shit is because I did some research into how insanely optimized it is and how much actual thought went into it and it's, it's fucking awesome. Like, I can't believe more game companies aren't willing to do it because Unreal Engine developers are like, so willing to just dive deep into everything and get some of the top nerds working on this shit. Like, I mean, they come up with solutions to things that should have been solved forever ago and just nobody wants to do. And like, they stand behind their support, their development, everything. Like, Unreal Engine 5 is what people should strive to at least come close to because you'd be able to run something at this level of detail if not much better for half of the performance cost guaranteed unified across a variety of drivers in, in so many different ways without having to compromise on stuff like like I said I, I had to get a $500 card well let's, well, let's be honest it was 450 but after tax and stuff, yeah, $500 card to be able to play this very enjoyably at 1080, okay, in 2023 in full settings. So, it's still kind of crazy to me. But let's get in here. And let's see what's going on. Oh, I forgot to mention the most important part of this build, the Samsung 970 Evo Plus um, M2 SSD. The thing is fucking crazy. It can transfer two and a half gigabytes per second optimal, like constant. It's gigabytes, not bits. Incredible. yourself anymore major our friend here showed me your sample suffice it to say not here hold on one second turn that down just a little bit let's talk somewhere more private Alu said we could use the back Okay, dude, one thing I hate about Bethesda, why does everyone walk so freaking slow in follow and fetch quests? Come on! Go on, run! Oh, I feel light as a feather in this gravity. Oh, yes, indeed. Because it's 0.38 gravity, yes. Hey, what is that? Why is it just sitting here? Fuck. I can sneak faster than you guys. Come on. You fuckwits. Gotta say, they did pretty good, though. I mean, look at the, the weapon effects there. Look fucking awesome. Like, that's, that's pretty badass. So goofy, look at this 
No, get back here. <laughs> Looking at. Wish I had taken an easier job. Maybe you should have, dumbass. So don't, I wish there was more to do around here. Drinking gets old. Understandable. Drinking's bad. It's haram. Okay. Wait a minute. Did they just? Ah. Was I supposed to do that? Guys, why the fuck did we just come back here? What? What? What was that? Why did we go all the way up there and back for nothing? Fucking idiots. Really? We're... What the, what the fuck was that? Okay, that was stupid. Lou gave me the abridged version of what went down. Yeah, I can't thank you enough for taking care of all that. Yeah, serious. There's two of us. I hope it ultimately didn't end up being too much trouble. Nothing is too much trouble for me, okay? I'm... I'm a boss. That's... Well, that's certainly not what I was expecting you'd have to go through. But thank you. I'm just glad you both came through intact. So, were you two able to get that work up together? Got it right here. That sample? It's an exact match for the ones from Londinian. Londinian? That's... That's exactly what I was afraid of. Not thrilled to be the bearer of that kind of news. That's for damn sure. So tell me you've got some kind of plan for that workup. Well, right now, we've got more questions than answers. So I've been trying to figure out what it's going to take to access our old Terramorph data. Good place to start. What'd you find? It's in the archives. The Armistice Archives? Doesn't that mean we'd be dealing with the Cabinet? And the Free Star Collective? And House Varun somehow? Oh, not House Varun. Guess we can kiss They're like ISIS. Goodbye. I didn't think the Cabinet would be willing to hear us out either. But I called in some favors. They've agreed to hear us out on two conditions. One, they want to see this analysis you two have procured. Nice. And two, they want to discuss what happened on Tau Ceti. Good. With both of us. Oh, okay. Only ever read about the cabinet in civics class. Never expected I'd get to talk of them. It can be a daunting experience. Which is why I wanted to make sure, before you agreed to anything, we gave you the whole truth. Percival and I... We're not just researchers. We were military scientists, ran a division of the UC together that deployed aliens on the battlefield as weapons. Place I was hiding out. That was our unit's home base. I know. After some early fits and starts at other facilities, the place eventually became the heart of UC Xenoworks. I already know all of this. I read the terminals. A practice that's been banned ever since the armistice went into effect almost 20 years ago. Yeah, it was basically the Nuremberg trials at the end of the day, just with a different outcome, because let's be honest, that's what it was like. Yeah, I know all this shit. Oh, well, that, um, that means a lot. It's not something I'm exactly proud of. Sounds like somebody but it would was say that. that assignment that the UC asked us to explore deploying terramorphs on the battlefield. I know all of that. The project never got off the ground, but the data our team gathered is now sitting in the archives along with all the other information banned after the colony war. Hmm? Under the watchful eye of monitors from all the galactic factions still participating in regular politics. Mm -hmm. But if we can convince the cabinet to help us access that data, It'll give us the tools we need to decipher what exactly this sample might mean. That. And hopefully, how to prevent more attacks like the one that spawned it. Well, you don't really need to do all that. I'm here. I'm technically from the past and the future at the same time. And I'm something that you simply cannot conceive of existing. So, I can handle the entire galaxy if you're really concerned. But let's, uh, sure, Hi. why not? Good luck. I don't need good luck. I've got good skills, bitch. What's up, guy? I'm just gonna wait until that drug's in production. And I'm telling everyone, Percival and I saved Mars. Fuck you, oh, uh, soy you. boy. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. And me. And me. Motherfucker.
All right. Well, that's a good segue as well. Let's move on to the next section of this quest. Hope you all enjoyed this little part of the walkthrough. It's going to get more interesting here. Walkthrough. Did I just call this a walkthrough? Playthrough. Not a walkthrough. It's a playthrough. So, hope you all enjoyed this, man. We're going to get right back to the rest of it very shortly, and the fucking camera is bugged. Anyways, thanks for watching. Assalamualaikum.